guys, my name is Carissa. This is my YouTube channel. And today I'm going to be doing a little mini haul with Avenue's little sister store called Laura Let. I also got one of the new swimsuits from the Gabby Fresh Swimsuits for All line, and I wanted to show that to you guys. I haven't even tried it on, so I don't know how it's gonna fit. We will see. So some of you might be familiar with Avenue. It's been around for a pretty long time. They make plus size clothing up to size 32. I really like their jeans. I've worn them a few times in the past on Instagram posts and stuff. Um, I like them. I think that they're a good resource for plus size people to be able to find things that actually fit and are pretty cute. They also sell really, really great wide calf boots. So when I found out that they were coming out with a new, more youthful line called Laura Let, I was pretty excited. Um, I do think that this falls into the more Juniors Plus range than maybe Avenue does. Their sizing is a bit more like Forever 21, I believe. But I figured I would try a few things on for you guys. You guys can see how they fit. I think that I've hauled maybe one or two pieces from Laura Let before in a collective haul. I can't quite remember, but I think I did. Anyway, let's get into it. I feel like my videos have been very long, very, very lengthy lately. So I'm going to try to make this a little bit of a quicker haul because I don't know. I like differentiation between times in my videos. I think that that's nice. So the first thing that I got from Laura Lett is this floral blouse. Um, the floral on it is very, very pretty. I am a little bit confused by this blouse because I, I'll show you guys the picture of the model wearing it, but I can't tell if your boobs are supposed to go, like if it's supposed to be more like peplumy or if it's supposed to be like, like a blue on top where it like just poofs. When I wear it, I get like my boobs, like the line is like right here. Oh, kind of like this one. Um, do you see how this goes like this? But I can pull it down where it then fits like an umpire waist. This is not my favorite piece that I got from them. Um, I do have a hard time like moving my arms in this. Everything that I got from them is a 3X. This is definitely like a junior's 3X. The pattern is really cute, really sweet. I like it a lot. It just doesn't fit. It just doesn't fit. I don't know what else to say about that. The next piece that I got is the shirt that I'm wearing. The little pink knit shirt and it has that like baby doll look to it. I really like these shirts. I wish I would have maybe got it in black. I don't wear a lot of pink and I didn't anticipate myself liking this shirt as much as I did. I didn't anticipate it being as comfy as it is. I like this a lot. The buttons button all the way up and down which I'm super into when buttons actually button and unbutton. This is very cute and very comfy um, just like with most juniors plus size stores if you are like a 4x or a size 26 and you just barely size out of their clothes if you look at what the fabrics are and you make sure that they're like knits and they have a little bit of stretchy material it can be a lot easier to shop at those places if you find something that you really really like even though I'm a size 26 28 I can still wear 3x shirts a lot of the time because if they're stretchy and comfy then squeeze me in it I also got a pair of leggings from Laura Lett. They have this cute little crisscross on the bottom. They are maroon colored. These are a bit snug on me. They are incredibly soft. Maybe some of the softest leggings I've ever put on. But definitely when I pulled them up, I was like, oh, I'm gonna rip a seam. And I'm pretty sure that if I bent over too hard, I would definitely blow the butt out of these. <laughs> they are very soft, very, very comfy, and super cute. They're just a little bit too snug on me. So I would say if you're a 4X, you're not gonna be able to squeeze into these 3X leggings. But I definitely think they are a true 3X. I don't think that these junior sizes are like Forever 21 where you get it and you're like, this 3X is like an XL. No, I think that they're like a true 3X. I also got this little striped dress. I really like this dress. I think it'll be nice just to go to the pool and on summer days to just throw on and lounge around the house in. The fabric is very, very soft. All of these pieces, the fabric are like really, really nice quality. It's thick. It's not like thin, stretchy cotton. It's like, it's substantial. It feels nice. Like the inside of this almost feels like a sweatshirt weave. It's really comfy. Um, if you order from Laura Lett, of course, it's an online only store. So they have these tags that say garment is not returnable. If you take these tags off, make sure that because if you're like me, you get everything, tear all the tags off, 
then try it on and uh, people have started doing this like returns only accepted with these tags so make sure you keep the tags on when you're ordering online they do have a pretty decent um, exchange and return policy so just be mindful of that when you are trying things on I also bought a little cardigan from Laura Let. I almost never buy cardigans. Oh, I think that when I first started like doing plus size fashion stuff, I saw a lot of plus size people always covering their arms with like cardigans and stuff. And I think that I got like, I don't know, a little bit sour about cardigans and about sweaters. And I was like, I'm never buying sweaters. And of course, they're actually like a really nice piece to have in your closet because you can layer them, you can take them on and off they look fucking cute but I think that I just like became a little sour about people covering their arms with cardigans for a while so I never bought them I'm back into cardigans and this one is exceptional I like this a lot the weave is very pretty it's like a chunky knit weave it has pockets on the side and it's just I mean it's lightweight and it's cozy and it's just a good little sweater so these pieces um, this one was $49 I believe that the dress was was 55 and then I think the shirts were around like 25 I do think it is a little expensive for what it is uh, their selection is not huge which I assume that is because they're pretty new so like I don't think that this is a $50 sweater I do think it's a $35 sweater which you know they have sales very often so you can make it a $35 sweater I didn't get a chance to try any of their like jackets though and their jackets did look really cute and they did look fairly reasonably priced so maybe that's something on their site that um, would be worth the full cost of the item Meh. so the last thing that I'm gonna haul is the Gabby fresh swimsuit I believe this is called uh, like the prairie suit I've seen it on a few people Gabby looked fierce as fuck in it in all of the ads um i ordered the size 26 bottom um when i got this i immediately thought oh shit that bottom looks small like the bottom doesn't look small but the waist to the bottom looks pretty small it does stretch an awful lot the top is exquisite it's beautifully constructed it is this is a beautiful 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 suit I got this in a 26 D double D which is the normal size I would wear I would usually order like a 44 46 D or double D it fits beautifully I'm obsessed with it I'm so so glad that I didn't just look at these bottoms and think no those aren't gonna fit because they're comfy and they fit beautifully you guys that's it for this haul how did we do on time is this video a little bit shorter do you like them a little bit shorter would you like longer videos how do you guys feel about vlogs for this year uh, I feel like making a separate vlog channel when you only have 60,000 subs is a little bit excessive so I would just like throw the vlogs on here I don't know how you guys feel about that how do you feel about it I'm thinking about it I'm gonna be doing some fun things with my life over the next year and I thought maybe it would be fun to include you guys anyway leave a comment make sure you give this video a big thumbs up please take a minute to subscribe and hit that notification bell uh, notifications are wonky everywhere right now so you know if you're following me on Instagram make sure you have notifications on over there too because it's fun over there and they just keep hiding everybody's posts I don't know why okay y'all that's all I have I love you. I will see you next time. Bye.